Hello guys, welcome to the ESP32 bare metal tutorial series. The primary motive of this series is to control the hardware using bare metal code or minimizing the use of hardware abstraction layer provided by the vendor. So to get started we first have to install the SPIDF toolchain. And before getting started, I am using Ubuntu for the entire tutorial. I will be using Vim Editor for writing the code and I will mostly be using the terminal to get my work done. I recommend using any sort of Linux distributions for this series as it could provide you a better productive workflow. With that being said, let's get started. So, first open your browser and search ESPIDF install. Now click on Linux and Mac OS. Go to Install Prerequisites. Here you can see certain commands that you have to copy paste to your terminal to get the ESPIDF toolchain installed. So open the terminal and follow these steps. This will take a little bit of time to clone all the repositories. I am fast forwarding this step to make this video shorter.
I have installed the tool chain successfully as you can see it shows the ESP IDF version. Now there are a couple of steps that you should do so that you don't have to export the source variable each time you open the terminal. These commands are not available in the website, so I will put that in the description. Paste this command at the end of this bash file. Now press Ctrl plus X, type the letter Y and press Enter to save and exit. Now run this command to run the bash file so that the environment variable is set up. Now you can see the environment variable loads automatically whenever I opens up the terminal. Alright, so that's the end of this video. We have successfully set up the ESP IDF toolchain, and we can start making projects with the help of it. As our first project we will be doing, Blink LED, using bare metal in the next video. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, kindly like and subscribe.